YouTube. Welcome back. Make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. Make sure y'all hit the like button. Make sure y'all hit the share button to check this out. Let's talk about the reason Money Bag Yo signed to Yo Gotti. Now, what a lot of people don't know is Yo Gotti had been trying to sign Money Bag Yo for like a minute, but Money Bag Yo just ain't ever want to do it because of the politics and all this and that, right? So, Gotti came to him, he like, look, I'm going to make you one last final offer, <laughs> right? Matter of fact, no, nah, I ain't even finna make you the offer. What do you want? You know what I'm saying? Money bag, yo. Told him what he wanted. But I told him I had his name. I got you. So there you go get to him, okay? He signed with him. Now look, Money bag, yo, has said a million times himself that he wasn't supposed to sign with yo guy. Money bag, yo, has said a million times himself that he wasn't supposed to be over there. We yo got This is a fact. He noticed, right? And this is the whole thing about it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Now, everybody knew that this was called this would cause problems, tensions, and what have you, and this, that, and the third by him signing with God, which is why it took a long time for it to get dead in the first place, right? But then too. At the same time, when yo God when um money bag started doing the uh bread game ent thing, he was having a little beef behind that, like with certain people. You see what I'm saying? So it's like it's like you in the hood and you know you got love beefs, but it's like they not that serious. It's just that they probably looking at you a certain way because you doing a certain thing or whatever like that, right? So now all this is like a known fact, but he still went over there and did that with Gotti. Now everybody know what happened. Y'all know we anti snitching over here is not supported at, at all. You know what I'm saying? So issues happen between Yo Gotti camp. And money bag yo them count. But before y'all knew about money bag yo, yo was popping. OG Boo Dirty. Now look. When I first heard about OG Boo Dirty, I'm OG. I'm OG. Man. I said this dude hard. <laughs> like, that was my first. And, and, and when I heard that, I ain't even know that he was into it with. Yo, Gotti or the camps or the crews with it. I ain't even know. I just heard that and I'm like, man, this song hot. Oh man. When they really, really got into it, and OG Boo Dirty and King Gas Star started doing them diss songs and dropping their mixtapes. Oh man. It was hard. <laughs> it, it, it was hard, bro. It, it man, they was going so hard. And it, and it was gangster. And the worst part about it. It was documentation to back up the fact that it was true. So, so at the end of the day, <laughs> everything OG Boo Dirty rapped about, everything that man said he was, he was. I know somebody finna come over here and they gonna be like, nah, he wasn't it. You can't tell. No, I'm not on it. Wanna hear that? Don't tell me that man wasn't who he said he was. I, it's proof. Like you go look at the Vlad interviews. You Google look at the paperwork. Like he was real with it. You feel me? And so, you know, people died and people got hurt. You know what I'm saying? For real. Like, this was this was real. People lost their life. People got injured. You know, things happen. You feel me? But the industry feared OG Boo Dirty. They, they feared him. They feared him. But like I told y'all in the video from earlier, when Gucci looked at Yo Gotti like, oh, so you in the industry and you messing with my ops. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to Memphis and I'm gonna get your op. And he was finna go on a nasty run with OG 
who dirty he was gonna blow him up i forgot what happened with the situation but they had some hard songs together and they was doing music together and they was finna be moved but i don't think og boo dirty ever signed to him but i think he was but when yo Gotti pulled that move he pulled that's what made Gucci go rock with OG Boo Dirty and bro. OG Boo Dirty was already hard. I don't care what nobody say. I don't care how nobody feel. If you come over here talking about he want this and that, I can only assume you was one of the people he was terrorizing. Cause it's all documented and it's all facts. Nigga, even Akon know. Hey, you don't, you don't nobody listen to Buddha, but hey, go ask Akon. Cause even Akon know. You feel me? And that's what happened. Like. It is what it is, y'all. I mean, it, it, the truth, I mean, the proof is in the pudding, man. You got to, man, like, bro, like, it's like, I mean, what you going, you, I mean, you going to make a change for your life and, and your family life, all that, or you, you going to hold on to, like, the fact of, you know what I'm saying, the certain things that this or that that happen to your homies or whatever like that, man, hey. I ain't never been in that situation and had to make that choice. So that wasn't the choice for me to make. That was the choice money bag yo had to make. But like I said, even OG Boo Dirty, like he he squashed it down the line. Like what Guardian said, like, nah, like we was gonna like be off of that. But I mean, bro, if he that, that was probably one of the, the best things that he did because bro, if he would have kept going like Ain't nobody finna keep going to court fighting 30 years, fighting 30 years. Like, the man beating, <laughs> he be, look, going to war behind this and behind them, the man is beating life sentence cases. So, look, y'all gonna stop playing with OG Boo Dirty, man. Get that man his respect. Get that man his flowers. Get that man his roses, bro. Because he was really doing that in Memphis. And he was really going hard in Memphis. And it kills me how when these Memphis conversations come up, y'all be trying to leave him out. And y'all don't be trying to speak on him. And y'all don't be trying to get that man his credit, bro. Give him his credit. Who else was stepping like that? Now, I'm not saying he was the only one in Memphis. But I know, but at that time, as far as rappers went, man, listen. Yeah, he that. <laughs> but that's what happened. Hey, uh, so y'all get in the comment box. Let me know what y'all think. Do y'all feel Buddy Bag Yo was wrong? I mean, hey, let me know. It's your boy Buddha. I'm going to holler at y'all later, man. I'm out.